afternoon all that feels very strange to do a video for youtube without um holding a guitar i've got one here anyway just in case i start to panic <laughs> i'm gonna put it down um I was just, i've been meaning to do this for a while i should have said um there's a couple of people i need to acknowledge because um they put a word out for me or, or a shout out i should say um for me youtube channel um first of all will gelvin from will's easy guitar who did, on his uh, recent video about um fret work uh, he sent a few subscribers my way for which i'm very grateful will thanks for that and also ej's guitars from the um well as i was going to say from the inner circle but ej seems to be part of a ej is part of a um a community a guitar community which which um is called the inner circle and, and i've met quite a few people as a result of this ej did a vid does a video every month where he, he recommends um um youtubers with with not many subscribers he recommends their channels on on, on his channel which which is nice of him and uh, i've come across a whole raft of people with um because of this uh in a circle guitar community i i mean I, I i i think i was already part of the guitar community prior to that but um things have evolved and there's a whole list of faces that that have that have recently seen to appear i assume there's one or two and um, but i just thought I'd, I'd mention a few names as ej's guitars as i've said r23 locking nut <laughs> it's almost impossible for anyone not to have come across r2 an r2 r3 locking nut shout out in the last uh in the last month if if you if you're in the if you're in, involved in the uh, guitar side of youtube and um, there's an interesting fellow i've spoken to quite a few times called called brian and his channel is called brian's fingerless guitar um and he's called fingerless guitar for obvious reasons because on his left hand there's a bit of a um bit of a shortage of, of uh finger mass <laughs> but he plays really well regardless poo ninja poo ninja Dan Anderson, who just makes about ten videos a day of him playing with uh, with with his with his Schecter. Uh, and they're usually about a minute and uh, usually about a minute and a half long. I think he just sits there all day playing guitar and then then he then he has a meal and then he goes to bed and he gets up the next day and plays guitar. <laughs> Dave Byron, GT Guitar TV, Guitar Hack, I am Soda Pop Todd. Empirism I've spoken to a few times as well. Guitar Girl KB and Jason Wade. And uh, I had to write these names down if there's anyone I missed, which I obviously did. There you go. But that's 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 the inner circle or what, what I understand of it to be. Um, so, um, as I say, I don't usually do much talking on YouTube. It's generally me playing... Um, and trying to teach people what I know. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a music teacher. I'm a qualified music teacher. Um, these days I tend to teach um, whole groups of, of um, kids, um, beginner guitar and, and ukulele, as a kind of vehicle towards teaching music. Um, and also I play, I play, uh, I play live but I haven't, I haven't played live for a couple of months because i left me i was in a band for about seven years and i left this year it was moving in the wrong direction i thought um so it was time for me to go i've got a couple of projects on the uh on the on the back burner hopefully hopefully to start in the new year um and i'm i'm thinking that it might be a good idea to use uh things that, that i care with regards to playing, you know, in a live band to make some YouTube videos, if you see what I mean, rather than just um, f filming a, a, a guitar lesson or or a, or a performance of a song or, or whatever. So don't be afraid to subscribe to my channel and uh, send me some likes and all that sort of thing. I don't think I've ever said in a YouTube video, subscribe to my channel because... I feel as if it's a kind of obvious thing to say, but I, I get the feeling that it's not. It, I think it, it's something that needs to be said. It's not easy getting uh, 
attract uh, people to come to your channel to watch and even if they do it's not easy to get them to watch it <laughs> most people only watch according to me uh, statistics most people generally don't watch over two minutes so um if you've made a video that's like 30 minutes long <laughs> it's a bit hard to take such is life but i'd like to think that the um that the you know the tutorial videos where i'm teaching techniques or or some music theory um you know people gonna people are gonna come to them and say there's a little bit of something in there that, that i need to know so i'm gonna go and find it and have a look at it so it doesn't really matter if it's not you know if it's not all being watched in one go um so with any luck there'll be a lot more coming from me this year um hopefully a few more a few collaborations to um to make things a little bit more interesting uh, and I think that's it so see you soon folks